Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is episode 13, season one, and we are going to be writing lyrics today. So I got my buddy Parker Kendham in Colorado, and he is going to be working with us to get these lyrics solidified for this song that we've been working on. If you haven't watched the previous episodes, go back and check them out. Uh, we made chords, established tempo, um, created some bass lines. So at the end of the day, I'm excited, he's excited, we're excited. So the main thing we wanna do is say thank you so much for watching this and take care. Someone could say that we took the chance. With everything that's going on, like we all need to like wave at each other, say hey, and like be forgiving, forgiveness, and just I don't know, positive stuff. Prescribe and blight. Throwing daggers. Love songs are great. Oh. <laughs> that was my. Uh... All right, guys, we have a uh, Parker Kingdom with us. Uh, thank you, Parker, uh, for joining us. Hey, no problem, man. Happy to be here. Let's make a great song. Um, what are you currently working on right now? My, uh, it's like an EP, I guess, called uh, Adjustment Disorder. I'm working on a song called Air It All Out. The vibe and the political atmosphere I find to be its extraordinarily uh, crazy right now, but inspiring. People are going to ask, like, why should we listen to you and Devin? We're extremely versatile. We can make anything happen. And with the years we've had, I mean, I think I've known you for four years, you yeah. know? So over the course of that time, we might have been responsible for 40 songs. So. Yeah, and as ghostwriters, you know, we when we do design a song or write a song for somebody, you know, we legally do uh disassociate with it song was our child and we raised it but now it's like off to college the first thing we need to do is kind of check out the instrumental here we go here's the intro getting high school prom vibes yeah. verse so it's just midi parts i've created all of it's going to be real musicians after after we come with the lyrics. Going into a little break. And then, that was another verse right there. And then after that, I think we're doing another break. And then we're going to jump into the chorus is coming. Right? Almost. Here we go. Here's the chorus. This last verse is only half a verse. So it's like verse one, break, verse two, chorus, verse three, break, verse yeah. four. I can't help but think or go back to my first impression of it. And right away I was imagining like the prom king and queen that nobody expected. Everybody's like, what? It's kind of like a movie and they're dancing. But then everybody's like, we should start dancing too. I mean, that's the theatrical part <laughs> that I'm envisioning. Tonight. Do that one more time. Sama, some, 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 That's nine syllables. I, I survive. People might think, oh, some, 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 say, some, say, some. What is that? No, that has actually mathematical value here because... Okay. That's nine syllables. Okay. I think I have something for the break. So it's like, All right. sometimes we drift apart, but I'll always find your heart. Yeah, yeah, I no, just, I'm with you. Know, like, you know, you just got to jot things down, even draw little pictures. There's a couple that in the summer they can see each other professing their love that they can only have this one season. Yeah. People are part of the Pokemon Go community. Go if ahead, you're yeah. part of Arvada and Friends, yeah. just... Help me join the community. I just wanted to play in the tournament today. And yeah. Yes. Yeah, sometimes they do drift apart, but uh, they're gonna end up getting married most likely. It's, a, it's pure love. Love songs are great. So we love it. Happened so fast. And I just got a text. Let me let me see what Parker's thoughts are. He might change the direction completely. He's done it before, or he might be feeling the vibe. So sometimes we drift apart, but I love. 
then we can go either to a chorus or we can go to another verse. So that works out great. I love people for now. Can you play that first part of the verse? Okay. And then right here. Oh yeah, this is Say hope, yeah. Yeah, don't but I say save the day. Someone could say we move too fast. A sinking ship heading down, down, down. But we never look back when the wind would last. Yeah. We were well equipped, we were built to last. Yeah. So I'm like, I don't know. I'm just. We'll let the singer do all that, but yeah, I think verse one's done. We build and build, and then we tear down and build again until it's we done. We scribble, yeah. we scribble, and then we get the cheese and we nip. Verse one is a, is a class act. Then what we do now is we say, guess what? This is like a puzzle. It has pieces to it. We already identified the pieces. The pieces have numbers tied to them. Someone could say that five syllables. We moved too fast so it's like nine syllables five and four so now it's just like what do you want to say that matches that Cut. for the next the video if you see me walking down the street don't forget to smile and wave at me if you see me walking down the street Okay, so it sounded like you want to say walking don't down forget the street. To, I mean, I don't know what I was saying, but it was something that I did in a previous uh, episode that there was something that was a vision I had. Like, if it was a music video, it would cut to like me walking down the street and then seeing somebody, and then like maybe we had beef or maybe not, but like with everything that's going on, like we all need to like wave at each other, say hey, and like be forgiving, forgiveness, and just, I don't know, positive stuff. All right, guys, y'all give Parker a hand, all right? He's doing a great job. This is his first time, and, uh... Out as strangers, met as teenagers, throwing beggars, Cupid was throwing beggars. Send me the lyrics. Let me sing it on my end. All right, guys, he j a new one just came in. So this is what I'm doing for you guys out there in TV land. Parker is literally sending me the lyrics here. We started out as strangers, and I said teenagers. Cupid throwing daggers, got Cupid throwing daggers. Started out as strangers. See, a harmony can come in later, guys. We are perfect, man. We are a perfect match. 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 That is perfect. We are a perfect match. We are a perfect match. Oh, all we need now is verse two and the half of verse three. I wrote Cupid in the song lyrics. Cupid's on my hat. I'm glad we captured. I'm glad we captured. Shout out. Shout out Jay Luck, Xavier. Jay Luck. He was wondering how you were doing, and I said, "Hey, he's doing good." And he was like, "Man, we had some great times." Yeah. <laughs> I'll I'll just say one one phrase, and hopefully it takes you back. But hey, yo, Rumple, <laughs> <laughs> think outside the box, or you can kick rock, kick rock. So there's this wonderful uh, website. I think it's also an app. Oh, rhyme zone. It's awesome. You literally type in any word. You can get rhymes. Near rhymes. And my favorite part as a writer is you can see everybody who's written that rhyme. So you can be like, oh, you know what? I was going to say this, but Prince already said it. So, again, so right now, 
I'm, I'm essentially looking for something to rhyme with last. Last, it doesn't make sense. So then one of my own near rhymes to last was chance, because I thought I could sing it like that. So then I just looked up chance, and all of a sudden I got a totally better result uh, that would work for the song. Chance in the comments, we want to know, is it crayon or is it crayon? Oh, but I'm going to try to say the word last and chance. I'm going to ask Parker <laughs> to do the same, and I want you guys to post in the comments below who did a better job. Last chance. <laughs> that was my, uh, all right, Parker, you oh, give it a go. You give it a go. Chance that. All right, I think Parker <laughs> won that one. Anyways, someone could say that we took the chance. I almost think that for this half verse, it could just be something. Someone could say that. Yeah. You, you can repeat it twice too. Like, something that's like yeah. It's gonna, oh, I like it. If we're repeating it twice, it goes like this. It goes, up on uh, the timer, guys. I gotta restart the A63. Hold on one second. <laughs> the beginning of a melody has to contain every note, the, the root, the third, and the fifth first. And that's what I did here. Except I skipped the fifth, I broke a rule, and I went to oh, another man, note and came back to on. And see, that's the thing. I literally, me. so like the whole song, I just sent it to Devin in the exact order. And okay. Be, we're professional here. I'm running this. I'm saying. <clears throat> Someone could say that we move too fast. A sinking ship heading down, down, down. But we never looked back, we knew it would last But we were well equipped, we're built to last And sometimes we drift apart But I'll always find your heart Someone could say that I took the chance Thinking quick this time around, round, round. But we never looked back, we knew it would last. Deeply in love, you make my heart dance. And sometimes we drift apart. But I'll always find your heart. Start as strangers, metals, teenagers, Cupid throwing daggers, cock Cupid throwing daggers. Yeah, the verse needs yeah, to be twice as long. That's where I got confused. Summer Cupid. And throwing daggers. Hold up, guys. Great job. Where? How, how do they, if they want... To get lyrics from you or they want your advice that's where i got confused it's like how do people get to know you and and all that and where how do they get a hold of you i think the best way to contact me for that kind of stuff because i will do features or i can write songs i mean you could literally give me one word that you want in there i could make you something but um so i guess soundcloud.com slash the real park city i definitely think you need to check out my song take my flow a bunch of people would argue uh touch of sun if there was one thing that you could share with people before you go out anywhere make sure your phone is charged the phone so simple it's going to prevent you from getting a torn deltoid and jumped by a by a homeless person <laughs> downtown at like three in the morning and it's you could avoid a lot of problems xavier hit me up before i hit you up and said he says this funny thing he's a very good fan and i think he'd have a lot of feedback for you man thank you xavier thank you xavier thank you xavier thank you xavier hey, everybody if you really want to get inside like the brains of musicians and writers and everything you just need to prescribe and blike uh, that's really all we need to do. You could trike, but we'd rather have you blike and uh, just blike it. We, we make the best videos.